Ага. 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 Let's go live. We're gonna go live. There we go, supermercado. Que calor, que calor. Que levanten las manos. Oh, hey, oh. I'm over here dancing just because you're not seeing me right now. I'm live on Facebook right now. Good morning, Double R Radio. Where are we at? A las 10.24 por la mañana, el 14 de octubre, 2021, 73 grados aquí en San Antonio. Hey, that's pretty good Spanish, right? That wasn't too bad. I was in Laredo yesterday, and I had to use some of my Spanish. I'm not lying to you, man. I went to go gas up. I went inside to use the regiment of Valero, and I had to use my Spanish. Oye, es este amigo. Amigo, ¿dónde está el baño? El, el baño a, 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 a pipi y pupu. Está el baño, a pipi y pupu. Digo, oh, que del baño, oh, amigo, ahí, ahí está el baño, ahí, amigo, eh, pero, pero, este, alguien está ahí adentro. Hay que hacer pipi pupu. Digo, sí, sí, yo entiendo, pipi pupu, pero ahí, ahí, ahí está, el, 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 alguien está ahí adentro, yo creo, no sé. I went over there, nobody was there, took care of business. Que más, gracias, amigo, por todo, gracias, por ser bien amable, amigo. Yes, he goes, yeah, adios, amigo, pee pee poo poo. And I go, okay, adios, adios. There you go. So I practice my Spanish just a little bit, you know, in Laredo. There you go. You know, I got to touch up on all that stuff. Good morning, shout out to Manuel Rios. He said, good morning, brother. Good morning. Also, good morning, shout out to my primo, Roger Rivers. Good morning, primo. How are we doing? Oh, hey, primo, I was seeing that cookout you were having the other day, primo. You should have let me know, man. We could have sold some plates. Twelve dollars a plate, primo. Una ferecita en la side, primo. There we go. Anyways, este, ahí se me añó, eating at mi rancho alegre. Allá en el rancho alegre. Ah, uh, yeah, no, that's, uh, allá en el rancho grande. Es no, el rancho alegre. Anyways, good morning, Shadow Ganata. Seguin, Texas, en la casa. Star Reyes, good morning. Este, la estrella de Seguin, Texas. Anyways, here we are Thursday morning and a whole mess of rain out there right now. I mean, it was raining so hard last night, I saw a duck with an umbrella. No, well, that wasn't funny, right? Okay. It was raining so hard outside, I saw the elephant man. He took off his paper bag and put on the plastic one. No, that's not funny either, right? Okay, I, I got you. Okay, all right. Ah, good coffee, man. I am drinking a coconut caramel coffee. Coconut caramel. You're probably going, mira que chiflado, coconut caramel. Uh, well, it's good stuff. It really, really is. Good morning, Jada. Good morning, Lisa Hernandez. Good morning, Lisa. How are we doing? Anyways, uh, like I said, here we are Thursday morning. What I'm going to do, let, now before I go there, let me talk. I got a couple of things here. There we go. Um, Let's see here. According to news reports out of San Diego, they had these very rare owls in San Diego, the San Diego Zoo. They had a mama owl, a papa owl, and a baby owl. And uh, according to news reports, they're claiming that the baby owl was either stolen or the baby owl left. But there's no more baby owl, only a papa owl and a mama owl. Uh, according to the dad, the dad said that the baby owl just didn't give a hoot about anything. No, that's not funny, right? I got you. Okay. Uh, let's see here. What else do I got here? Um, here we are. Japan. A 600-pound turtle was donated to a family of 10 so they could eat. <laughs> who donated? Who donated? If I were to see a starving family, I don't think, well, I'm, they're, they're starving over there. Let me go get a turtle and give it to them, and that way they can have papa. You don't think that way, right? Well, in Japan... Turtles are a delicacy. I didn't know this. Wow. I didn't know. They say in the, in the, the McDonald's, they got the McTurtle. And uh, also, it's the... <laughs> right. Right. But they say you got to be careful the way you, you eat turtles because you may get shell shock. No, that's not funny either, right? Uh. Well, anyways, a 600-pound turtle was donated to a starving family of 10 so they could have papa. I don't get it, man. Uh, I've never tried turtle. I've I've tried turtle wax, but I've never tried turtles. There we go. Good morning, Jada Ganata. Double R Radio sponsor, Cindy Martinez Hernandez, San Antonio, Texas. Now, what I'm going to do right now, let me see here. Did I have anything else for you all? Let me see here. Uh, mm, do, there we go. Here's another one. Delaware. 
a farmer in Delaware claims that his horse, while he was trying to brush his horse and keep it nice and clean, the horse kind of like threw a kick with a patada and hit him in the face. And now he says he can't remember too much of anything, only when he got kicked. So authorities in Delaware are calling it a Delaware punch. <laughs> no? Uh, I got you. Okay. All right. Quit trying, Robert. Okay, I'll, I'll quit trying. There we go. <laughs> turkey. A turkey resident was named the world's tallest woman at seven feet tall. You know, I tried dating a tall woman one time. I really, really did, but I had to return the ladder. <laughs> I rented a ladder for 24 hours. And said, I'll be right there, honey. I'll give you a kiss a -roo. There we go. Let me get the extension. There we go. We're going to get there. There we go. Uh-huh. <laughs> but I had to return the ladder, so there we go. Uh, forget that one, too. <laughs> Tough crowd, tough crowd. Anyways, what I'm going to do right now, let me see here where are we at. Don't want to miss anybody, anything. I think we're all good to go. There we go. He says, primo, primo, then a tri turtle at Southside Lions Park. I bet you he has. Parecen zapatos, esos tortugas. Now, that being said, what I'm going to do right now, you know, we're halfway close to Halloween already, and kids are kids, right? Kids get whatever kind of costumes they want. I love seeing the kids in their costumes. What I get a kick out of is going to, like, a Halloween costume party, a bar or whatever, when the adults are dressed up like whatever they want to dress up as. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to give you some of the top costumes that are out there that people like to wear, people like to put on. Now... Here we go. Let me give you some of the top costumes here. Uh, Pennywise the Clown from the movie It. You know, I've never seen that movie. I've never seen... You know, I never realized... Really, man, this is true till about three or four years ago. I never realized that there's a lot of people out there that are scared of clowns. No lie. I never realized this. Really, that people are actually scared of clowns. Makes you wonder, how does McDonald's survive, succeed, because they use a clown for their hamburgers, right? But anyways, there we go. Pennywise the Clown from the movie It is one of the top costumes for adults. Also, another one is a killer clown. <laughs> Forget the clown. This could be a killer clown for the girls. Women can dress up as a killer clown, okay? Another one that's top selling right now, Halloween, the Curse of Michael Myers Mask. Um, I was never too much into the movie Halloween. Maybe one, Halloween two, and that was about it. Another top-selling costume for adults is T-Rex costume. There we go. If you want to go dressed as a dinosaur. Huh. Um. <laughs> I don't get it. Why would you want to get dressed up as a dinosaur? I mean, jeez, man. I'm going to see what else. Uh, another one. Woody Fred Sanderson from Hocus Pocus. Who wants to be dressed like this? I don't even know who she is. Another one. Jack Skellington from The Nightmare Before Christmas. No bueno. Um, another one. World War II kissing sailor and nurse. Well, you know what? Forget the costume. Just bring me the nurse. <laughs> hey, I don't want the costume. Just give me the nurse. There we go. We'll be good to go. <laughs> Dressing up like that. Here's another one. A couple's costume. You can go as nerds. I know a lot of people that dress up like nerds. There we go. Nerds 2 flavor box. A guy and a girl. Did a purple box and a pink box together. You go as nerds. There we go. And uh, I don't care for here we go. Here we go, ladies. Um, you can go as a go go dancer with a garter belt. I think I like that one. I think she would get a lot of candies out of me. I I think she would. Here we go. The sexiest man's Halloween costume. You go naked with a basket in front of you with a whole lot of balls. <laughs> I'm not like hey pinche Moscow cabron. You go, you go naked with a basket in front of you with a whole lot of balls in front of you. I think it takes a lot of balls to you to wear that costume right there. One more. 
Damien. Who remembers Damien? You can go as Damien. There we go. Uh, what else? Wonder Woman. I used to know a girl, boy. Uh, <laughs> was she Wonder Woman? <laughs> and a couple of other words as well. Who wants to go as Wonder Woman? Let me see here. What else? Now, this is stupid right here. A couple's costume. You can go as peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> Why? Why would you do that? Come on, por favor. Let me see here. Don't want to miss anybody here. You want to go as peanut butter and jelly? I don't think so. Uh, let me give you a couple more here, man. I'm getting tired of these costumes. I really am. Um, I think that's it. Oh, also, you can go as a Crayola. Huh. Anyways, uh, what else? <laughs> I think that's it, man. None of these really get to me whatsoever. You know, I've never been one to go trick-or-treating, put on a costume, blah, 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 blah. But I just, I've never been that guy. I, I, I really just never been that guy. Good morning, Chara Leticia Perez. Good morning, Leticia. How are we doing? Anyways, um, weekend right around the corner tonight, game five between the San Francisco Giants and the L.A. Dodgers. Game one between the Houston Astros and the Boston Red Sox. Uh, tomorrow evening, 7.05 p.m. I'm definitely looking forward to that. I will be at home with my beers, a couple of shots, and some some a botana and all that other good stuff, man. Definitely looking forward to that. I really, really am. Anyways, where are we at? Tell you what, let's keep it going. Let's do something by Mr. Joe Bravo featuring Grupo Aviso. Good morning. How we doing, everybody? Thursday morning, it is. Got my coffee working. Kind of warm in here, man. I'm going to go crank up the AC. Let's get back to the morning show. Join me now. RobertRevisRadio.com. Simple. RobertRevisRadio.com. And click on that media player button. Also, as the, um, what else? Oh, yeah. If you're looking at me at YouTube right now, be sure and subscribe, okay? Morning show time. <laughs> 